In a 3D tool, we have a tool called piping. It's, it's here, it's a piping and it's editing tool. Look at this image. This is in piping. In a uh, close designing, we have something like this has a, a pipe on it. It's a fabric that's um, piping around the edges. You can simulate it in this software with the piping tool. In this edge, for example. <clears throat> Select the piping tool and you have to work in 3D. As you can see, this tool is, uh, you can use it in a uh, 2D, but I think it is better. As you can see, it does not, if you want to, uh, as you can see, it's a 3D, it's one to uh, going around, around here for better understanding the software, click. And as you can see, you can click, click, and then to the finish, click. And the piping is, adding to this part as you can see okay the in this part the piping is uh, <clears throat> exactly the default fabric here you can uh, go to the library at the fabric and <clears throat> you can define any fabric that you want uh, <clears throat> for doing that you have to go to the edit and you can select this piping and in its properties you can change the name uh, you can see the length, you cannot change it. Width, if you want, you can change the width. And here, you can change the fabric deck to insert it here. In the, for example, fur, as you can see. <clears throat> or any fabric that you want. For example, going here, this is a fur. You have to see it in a render. And for example, I change the color here to better see it. Uh, but uh, you have to change the texture on a fur. So I can add another, change the color to the red and going to select the piping tool and select this fabric number one. <clears throat> and if you simulate, as you can see, we have a piping here, but this is a facet. Here you can change the particle distance, a smaller number cause, oh, it cannot be smaller than one. As you can see, it causes the better co uh, quality of piping. <clears throat> uh, select the piping tool that I assigned here. You can assign it in a 2D and a 3D. Here you can change the widths. For example, one. As you can see, we have more widths here. It's a piping. And I wonder that we can know. You cannot go uh, below the one here. You can hide it if you want it. It's a zero. Okay, this is um, just a piping. It's very easy and simple and straightforward. And as you can see in a fabric, you can assign a different fabric to, to your piping uh, section. And it's done. Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.